So guys, let's be real. For most people, going to the gym is hard. But what's even harder is going to the gym and not seeing any improvements. So when your hormone levels, especially your testosterone, is declining or out of whack, you're going to have a harder time building muscle and burning fat with your workouts. On today's episode of Live Lean TV, I'm sharing the best exercises to boost testosterone naturally for men. And I'll also be covering why certain exercises are better than others, including which movements are also the best fat burning and muscle building exercises. So if you've been a subscriber of this channel, and if you're not, tap that subscribe button below and turn notifications on for good luck. And don't forget to tap the like button for just a little bit of extra strength. If you've been a subscriber of this channel, you've probably seen my videos on how I naturally raise my testosterone through proper nutrition, training, and changes to my lifestyle. But to summarize, I had my first testosterone test when I was 31 years old. The test results showed that my testosterone levels were in the low to mid 300s. Now, thinking back, I'm not that surprised as I was overtraining with the wrong exercises and the wrong type of workouts. I was overworked as a new entrepreneur and I was stressed out. And at the time, I remember having lower libido. I struggled with energy crashes and fatigue and I was probably showing early signs of depression. Now let's fast forward to 10 years later. I'm now a 41 year old dad of two young kids and I have naturally boosted my testosterone levels from the low 300s to between the high 500s and low 600s. And I did this naturally by following the eight nutrition, training and lifestyle tips that I shared in this video right here. But before I share the best exercises to boost natural testosterone, I wanna first talk about how do you know if your testosterone levels are actually low. Well, first, be honest with yourself. Do you feel like you're suffering from the common symptoms of low testosterone, including a reduced libido, poor sexual performance, fatigue and low energy, depression, a decrease in muscle mass, and an increase in body fat? If the answer is yes, the best way to find out if you have low testosterone levels is to get a blood test. So you can possibly do this by going to visit your doctor, or you can now get tested in the comfort and the privacy of your own home. So that leads me to giving a quick shout out to the sponsor of today's video, Let's Get Checked. Now Let's Get Checked is the leader in at-home testing. And personally, I've been using their at-home testing service multiple times over the past year to continue to test and monitor my testosterone levels from the comfort of my own home. To do this, simply go to the link in the video description below or at the top of the screen and order the Male Hormone Complete Testing Kit. So it literally arrived on my doorstep two to three days later in a small discreet package. Then all you have to do is make a small prick in your finger to collect a small blood sample, mail it back in the enclosed prepaid shipping label package to be tested in their lab. So then in two to five days, you'll receive a text message or an email to log into the Let's Get Checked app or on their website to quickly get your testosterone test results. And if necessary, a nurse can also be available to contact you with a consultation and explain your results over their phone. So now that you know how to test your testosterone levels at home, let's get into the best exercises to boost testosterone naturally for men. So first of all, obesity is one of the major causes of men with low testosterone. So one of the best ways for most men to naturally boost testosterone is losing fat. And when it comes to naturally boosting your testosterone levels, exercise is just one piece of the overall healthy lifestyle puzzle. So when you follow a properly structured workout program with the right types of exercises, the right type of diet, sufficient sleep and recovery, and lowering stress levels, that is the overall package and that is key. However, not all exercise is equal. So when it comes to exercise, the two types of workouts that are most beneficial in burning fat and naturally boosting testosterone are resistance training with weights and HIIT workouts. So following a weightlifting routine comprised of compound, multi-joint exercises with shorter rest periods just three to five times a week, it has been shown to increase testosterone after the workouts. 
In addition to resistance training, short and quick hit workouts are better when compared to longer endurance cardio, you know, low intensity steady state cardio to increase testosterone. So what is a compound multi-joint exercise? So most exercises can be classified as either a multi-joint or a single joint exercise. Now the biggest difference is a multi-joint exercise recruits more than one muscle at a time. So a single joint exercise tends to isolate only one muscle for the majority of the lift. So for example, a leg extension on a leg extension machine locks in the leg, thereby primarily isolating one muscle group, which is the quadriceps. So this would be classified as a single joint isolation exercise. Although most single joint exercises do use other muscles, they often use them to a much smaller degree. So compare this move with a compound multi-joint movement such as the barbell clean and press. So during a barbell clean and press, your body recruits many different muscles groups including the quadriceps, the hamstrings, the glutes, the calves, the shoulders, the back, and core. So based on this, which exercise do you think requires the most workload and energy to complete just a rep? Well, there is no question that a multi-joint exercise requires a higher workload to complete compared to a single joint exercise. And when I say workload, workload just takes into account the force times the distance. So the force is the amount of the weight times the amount of reps times the number of sets. And the distance is the distance the weight is moved in feet. So let's apply that formula to these two different exercises so we can see which exercise has a higher workload to complete. So here's the workload of a leg extension. Let's just say you're doing 140 pounds for 12 reps times three sets. The force would equal 140 pounds times 12 reps times three sets, which equals 5,040. And the distance that you move that weight is 0.5 feet. So the total workload of a leg extension would be the 5,040 times 0.5, which equals 2,520 pounds per foot. So now let's look at the workload of a clean and press. So let's say you're doing a clean and press with 135 pounds for 12 reps times three sets. The force would equal the 135 pounds times 12 reps times three sets, which equals 4,860. And you're moving that weight at a distance of four feet. So a total workload of a barbell clean and press is 4,860 times four, which equals 19,440 pounds per foot. So as you can clearly see, selecting the right kind of multi-joint exercise is key. Although you may be lifting a similar weight and completing the same amount of sets and reps, the barbell clean and press takes over seven times more work to complete in the same amount of time than a leg extension. So to sum it up, exercises with higher workloads equals more calorie burn, a better hormonal response, and a greater metabolic response in the body. These higher workloads are accomplished by focusing on a multi-joint exercise that recruits numerous different muscles, thus allowing you to lift more weight and require the weight to be moved in a longer range of motion and distance. So based on this, to naturally boost testosterone, the best exercises are compound, multi-joint movements that recruit the bigger muscle groups. These compound exercises will increase your body's resting metabolic rate, thus creating more calorie burn and eliciting the most beneficial fat burning and muscle building hormonal response in your body. So examples of compound multi-joint exercises include squats, which can be back squats or front squats, deadlifts, lunges, which could be a forward lunge, a reverse lunge, or a pendulum lunge, or a lateral lunge, step ups, hip thrusts, swings, including kettlebell swings or dumbbell swings, Presses, including a bench press, a shoulder press, dips, and push-ups. A clean and press, like a barbell clean and press, or a dumbbell clean and press. Snatches, including a barbell snatch, or a dumbbell snatch. Rows, pull-downs, pull-ups, and chin-ups. Now these compound multi-joint exercises should be the primary focus of your workouts to lose fat, build muscle, and naturally boost testosterone. So guys, let's be real. For most people, going to the gym is hard. But what's even harder is going to the gym and not seeing any improvements. And this is why we always include these higher workload exercises in our full body workout programs, such as our Awaken the Abs Within program and our Afterburn workout programs.
And when you join our workout app, you can get access to these exact 30 day and six week workout programs for only $1 today at the exclusive link in the video description below. So when your hormone levels, especially your testosterone is declining or out of whack, you're gonna have a harder time building muscle and burning fat with your workouts. And this is why I believe every man who is trying to optimize their health and their body, and that should be everybody, should consider getting Let's Get Checks Male Hormone Complete test. So this test will provide you with a look at all of these things you see on the screen, your testosterone levels, your sex hormone binding goblin, your free androgen index, your estradiol, your cortisol levels, and prolactin. The labs have the highest levels of accreditation and the entire process is HIPAA compliant, meaning your data is never shared with anyone. So stop guessing what your levels are and don't let your hormones hold your progress back this year, guys. You can get tested and get a 30% off your entire order at the link in the video description below using code lean 30 so as always guys we appreciate your ongoing support and keep